I'm scrawny, Dr. Abdurrahman. I'm meathead, Dr. Abdurrahman. Oh. I don't work out at all. That is gross. I work out all the time, baby. Oh. So which one is worse for you? Not working out at all? Or working out all the time. I'm scrawny Dr. Abdurrahman. You are scrawny Dr. Abdurrahman, but we're no longer in character. Oh, okay. I'm Dr. Jamal. I'm Dr. Idris. And this is today's medical moment. Oh. And on today's medical moment, we're asking, is it possible to get too much of a good thing? And the short answer to that question is, it is. There was a study that came out recently that looked at people who vigorously exercise every day, those who exercise moderately some days of the week, and those who don't exercise at all. And what it found actually was that people who vigorously exercise every day have a lower life expectancy than people that don't exercise at all, while the moderate Sunday exercisers had the highest life expectancy. Now on the face of it, that seems kind of surprising. We've always thought that if some is good, more is better. And in this case, that's not the case. But why is that? Well, cake, it isn't cake, you know. Well, yeah, more cake is always better. But when it comes to exercise, that's not the case. And the reason's actually pretty simple. You know, if you've ever exercised vigorously, especially on a daily basis, you know when you wake up in the morning, your bones, your joints, your muscles are killing you. And you have inflammation associated with it. And while it feels like that inflammation is localized to your knees, your elbows, whatever the case may be, in reality, that inflammation is systemic, so it's all over. And so all that inflammation does help to heal the damaged muscles, bones, and joints. At the same time, it's actually potentially damaging blood vessels in the heart and the brain. And therein lies the problem because those damaged cardiac and cerebral blood vessels increase your risk over time of heart attack and stroke. So in reality, meathead Dr. Abdurrahman and scrawny Dr. Abdurrahman were both wrong. The key is in moderation. Moderate exercise every other day is the key to a nice, long, healthy life. As always, folks, thanks for watching. Don't forget to follow us on Twitter at Twin Doctors TV. Check out our Facebook page, Twin Doctors. And don't forget to follow us on our lovely, stupendous, fantastic website, www.twindoctorstv.com. Dot com. Dot com. We're also on Pinterest. We're also on Instagram. Stay healthy, guys. And as always, moderation, baby. <laughs>